Whoops, that's too much bright light. <clears throat> yeah, there we go. That's close enough. I'm just going to fix the light a little bit. Well, you guys know I'm not Dom's vlogs. I'm not even in the right gear. I'm just got the hat on. But um, I hope you all are doing very well during this whole pandemic. But I have to get. I have to start to talk about something. And this is very important for my YouTube channel, but also my other YouTube channel, Toxic Nerfer. This is the most important thing for all of you who are going to be newly subscribed. Also to people who comment. Because I've been getting this the past three videos. And all I was talking about... As a matter of fact, I'm going to pause this and I'm going to be right back. So, for the past three videos... I've did this. My thoughts on The Fiend being back in WWE and with the new look and stuff. I've I've did that video. Then I also looked at the in the Mummy, the Brendan Fraser version that Emo Temp's curse was a very stupid one. And then the third one back, I did Underground Cities being a nice good concept for the apocalypse. Between all those videos, and I can't tell this is the same fucking guy, or female as well, it doesn't matter which one, because they all are held accountable to all this, have been sending me links to pornographic sites. I want to get this perfectly clear. And I'm trying to make this perfectly clear here, because I don't, I'm not going to make this personal. I'm going to make this professionally here. But, with my own words, stop sending me them. And that is a fucking statement. Stop sending me them. Because this time you send me that shit, I am not going to block you. Not just block your comments. I am going to report your fucking channel. Clear? Because I am going to make this clear. This is, a, this is a channel where I am here to criticize. I'm here to play video games. But I'm also to put my thoughts, my own opinions, on anything else. I've dealt with crap already. I've dealt with already on too much crap already. For somebody to send me that shit. If you want to send me something, then send me, oh, I don't know, maybe like a, a lucky picture of an old movie. Like something classic, or at least like... Uh, Leaks for Call of Duty zombies than, than sending me that shit. Because this is fucking un un unacceptable to the idiot out there or idiots sending me that shit. I don't know who you are. I don't know who you are. When I tell you stop, I mean it. I mean it. This, this is not a channel for your little surprises and for like people to get their rocks off. Because quite literally, I think you've done too much already. And now you're making me not do a Dom's Vlogs video tonight because the fact of that. So let's get this one thing straight here. There was a virus. I have to take not very good care of, not only just care of my family, but care of my friends and my family back in New York. Get this one thing straight here. I am not playing games. I am not playing games. I'm here to talk about my thoughts and my opinions. I thought The Fiend's return was cool. I loved his return to WrestleMania. I'm still questioning why both him and Bliss are kind of like, well, not together anymore, so to speak. Um, Character-wise, I, I said it again and I'll say it again. Emotem's curse was a very stupid curse. In my opinion, he shouldn't have been resurrected and having all these powers. He should have just been resurrected and he just figures out how to get powers like that underground cities is a very nice way for survival because the fact that it's an underground city sir we're going to still need oxygen but there are ways to make it happen that's my thoughts that's what i do i think you're doing this just because i have this let me get up here you think it because i have this right like i have this red lights I have red lights because, well, it's a new feature. I want to expand more light into this room. And not only that, these blink. I can find the button. Yeah, see? 
This is a channel for purposes that you should understand. We're not here to watch somebody get their rocks off. We're not here to say something that I think is very inappropriate. And for me, my thoughts to YouTube completely is to go after these people. Because not only are they violating that terms of service that I think is generally very important for their channel, but they're violating other terms of services as well. Don't ever send me something like that ever again. I am not going to take that kind of crap from you. And take this professionally, not personally. Sometimes you guys have so much arrogance that it's poisoning everybody. It's more or less infecting the entire YouTube, like, people. Have a little faint at heart. Tell me my videos are good. And, and just tell me why you don't like my videos. Just tell me. I'm curious. Curiosity. I'm a curious bird in the, in the wall. Don't just tell me, oh, it sucks, and just to get a rise out of me. No, give me a reason. Give me a reason. I like to know the reason. I'm not a guy here who's just trying to get a job. I'm a guy who's trying to get a job and, you know, live a life. I mean, look, I got a desk. I got a light. I've got a good computer. I got a good, a decent enough camera. Um, and I've been sketching too. I've been sketching. I've been, I've been trying to do some research lately as well. So enough, please. Enough sending me that crap. Because if you send me that crap in this video, I will come after you. I will literally come after you. And that is not any type of statement. I'm not going to do it with a smile. Hell no. I'm going to do it with my face. It's very that fucking serious. Stop it. Enough. I'm not that type of bullshit that, that you could be dealing with. And I'm not sorry. Ever. You've done, you've seen you've seen critics food everywhere. Even the harshest of critics out there are not sorry. You should know that. But no. You're just busy thinking about, well, well, what what video did I did I do that 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 made me say something that was very uh, inappropriate? Oh yeah, I've been saying that lately. Pearl being, yeah, like I did a Squidward impression of saying that Pearl being a prostitute. Now that at least is just a joke that I can handle. But if you're thinking that these are jokes, they're not funny. They're not funny. Unless you give me a joke like, why did the chicken kid the, even a basic joke, like, why did the chicken cross the road to get to the other side? So at least that could kind of be funny because it's the oldest joke. What about the oldest prank in the book? Um, mirrors. Why not come up with good ideas like I have instead of sending me shit like that? And I'm not saying everybody's sending me this crap. I'm just thinking of one particular person or a group. So I'm going to say it again, and I'm going to sign off with this. You send me that shit again. Now I'm making it perfectly clear for you. You send me that shit again. I will come after your channel. And not only that I'm going to come after your channel, I'm going to put a very big report on you that you are literally sending me that shit when I'm telling you, stop it. So, before I sign out, what's going to happen on, on the Wednesdays? Well, let's think about here. I'm trying to think of how I'm going to do Fridays. I might, but you're going to have to look on YouTube to find out if I'm going to do a live stream on Cold War. Because I hadn't really done a live stream in a while, I'm going to try with the new headset right here that I got, <clears throat> which is pretty much a bunch of wires. I'm going to try with this, the new microphone, um, nice and comfy. It's really, really nice. I'm going to try with this. Uh, Dom's Vlogs, on the other hand, um, I have no clue. 
I have no clue on what I'm going to do with Dom's vlogs because I hit burnout. That's what happens with most people when they create ideas. I hit burnout. So I have no idea what I want to post for Dom's vlogs on Wednesdays. So so my idea is I'm just going to have to wait and see. But again, this is the next time. Do not send me that shit ever again. But to all my people out there, to my, how many was it? 91? 91 subscribers. You continue to send me good things and at least some, and at least some good inspiration here. Maybe a video that you like to uh, tell me. Like, tell me what video I should do, at least. Like, tell me what video I should do in the comments, but my thoughts and opinions, anything, even a top list. Give me a top list that I think I can at least handle. But if there's anything I say no to, then it's a no. But if it's a yes, I'll do it. I'm just going to have to come up with some research. I'm going to have to, like, do really good with my editing skills. And then I will post it on next Wednesday. So for all of you 91 out there, and also to the Toxic Nerfer fans, don't worry. There are going to be new videos coming out soon as well. I just need the time. I need the patience. And you guys have been the greatest at my at my patience. So thank you so much. And I hope you did enjoy this uh, this autism month too, because it is autism month. And uh, I'm telling you, someone who actually has it, you've had no idea the hell I've been through. Like the ones who don't have it, like you don't know how autism is. Because not you still do with tough choices in life, but you also deal with the greatest parts of life. Autism, I think, is not a disease. It's mostly a disability, yes, but it's a disability that kind of works for the person. Because I think they're way smarter than an actual human being that doesn't have a disability, period. It helps. So, for some people who have disabilities, let's just say you guys are the troopers out there. You guys literally are pretty much what I would consider the, the smartest. You guys rule, and I'm part of it. And I hope we continue to make everybody proud with our disabilities and seeing that we would do everything. I mean, the doctors clearly said to my mom, I will never walk or talk, talk, period. I'm, walk, I'm walking the walk and I'm talking the talk. So you know it. <laughs> and I guess, I guess it's just because I am a very lucky boy. I'm a very lucky boy and I, and I'm, I always wanted to thank, thank everybody here. I thank my dad who's in, he who's in heaven. I want to thank my brothers and my sisters, my grandma, my ma, my little brother Jerry. I want to thank my stepfather. I want to thank my stepsisters. I want to thank everybody in my family and my friends for this lovely occasion of being probably, probably this great experience ever of being an autistic being. Because it's, because it's really a hell of a lot of fun, but the future is not, not yet. I'm waiting for that. And I am waiting for me to have a very happy time. And I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm literally ready. So I hope you all can figure it out. I hope you all enjoy. And I, I hope you all are enjoying these channels because the, because the future is now.